Hey, it's um, uh, Brandon. Uh, well, I'm I'm about to be playing one of my favorite games of all time, which it, it's 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 in the series of one of my favorite games of all time, but uh, it's not really that high up on my list. This particular game, which is probably the reason why I'm playing it, and the reason why it's definitely not going to be its own series. It's going to be playing a few games, matches. Or whatever of time splitters one. Screen's a bit shaky, of course. I don't think this was ever like I don't know. There's always something wrong with this screen, I think. Uh as always. Let's just load off of Bootylicious. I gotta turn the volume down a bit. Can't have that darn thing going. So as you can see, I've been pretty busy lately in this game, which is uh, it, it's it's okay. I don't know how I unlocked any cheats, but I'm um, a uh, it's pretty it's pretty nice. This is pretty much the furthest I've ever gotten in time splitters. I mean, I've never been one for unlocking stuff, and back whenever I did, I had no idea how to do anything. So just for the fun of it, we're gonna be playing some X. S Scort, because you know why not. And since we barely really have anything, might as well set up the teams. I don't know how any of this works. I haven't played this in forever. I'm more used to the Emma um, uh, GameCube version. We know how that goes. Alright, we don't want friendly fire, and we want everything else. Who should we play with today? We're always defending, so... Let's go with this dude. He looks like he knows a thing or two about... shooting. Not really defending that much. Alright, I got a faulty right joystick. Which... can't move that well. The loading times on this are atrocious, so I'm gonna take a quick pause. All right, so as you can probably see, we've just loaded. All right, let's do this thing. Ooh. Ooh, wait, what? What team am I on? Is I'm on Team Red? I don't know what's going on. I don't know who's who, but I think the blue team is bad. So I guess that's okay. Got explosions. Got everything pretty much. Hang on, let me adjust the audio again. I don't think I can. Darn, that sucks. And we lost. Alright, I need to go and configure some controls. Uh, update. Okay. I'll I'll do that. I mean, why not? Alright. Um, let's just hop on into Deathmatch in Chinese. This play is one of the most underrated characters, which I guess all of these aren't underrated. Somebody out to play as them. Let's play as this sir. dude. I'm going in. I always thought his um, uh, armor was pretty friggin' weird. Alright, I'm gonna need to take another cut real quick. Alright, we're back in fighting condition. And as you can see, Bootylicious is number one. Let's do this. Chinese is like the staple map in this series. Really. I have auto aim on. I don't know how to disable it, and I don't really care. As long as something helps me, that's pretty nice. Of course, what's well, not better than a rocket launcher? But of course, as you can see, I just killed myself. One of the weirdest things that I've always thought about this game is the fact that you can never see your dying character. Like in the other games you could, but in this game you can't. It's just kind of strange. 
And also the fact that there was a gap between like those character intros. Like whenever you select a character and they do stuff. It was like a pause, sort of. Like Town Splitters 2 didn't have them. Um, yeah, Town Splitters Future Perfect or 3. If you're feeling kind of accurate, um, they had those. Plentiful. Yep. Alright. Still getting these guys, it's pretty easy. Let me check the scores. Somehow, some way, some person finds a way to get negative six. There's always gonna be that one person. Alright, let's go do the thing. This thing would stop moving by itself. Ugh. I wish the um, uh, auto aim worked on the rocket launcher, but even then, I guess it would be sort of overpowered. That would that'd be pretty cool, though. But it's like near impossible to do any shots on anybody. I've always thought that it was the hardest to actually kill somebody on this game. Because it just seems a whole lot like it. Like it's just so fast paced that you couldn't really hope to hit anybody without auto aim on. I guess I was kind of stupid though. Because who would play this without auto aim? Unless you were trying to, like... Oh! The guy killed himself. Guess he didn't get the memo that I just spawned and have, like, five second immunity. That was a one in a million shot. One in a million shot. A million and one shot. Guess either way you can say it. I'm just owning... What is the kill limit? I don't even remember. But I can tell you, this is going along pretty slowly. Alright. Wow. I break like five glass windows before I'm able to land a single shot on that guy. Well, almost dead. Alright. Also, sorry I'm not being like that talkative, or at least trying to make a bunch of jokes. Because it's like 4 in the morning, I haven't slept yet. It's all fun. Alright, let's keep going. Fire this guy, you're fired. Alright, now I kind of regret leaving the rocket launcher on the weapon list. Honestly, one of the worst mistakes ever. Alright, let's get moving. Oh, jeez. Alrighty. Still at 15, mostly because of all the rocket launcher suicides I've done. Oh, I'm second now? Darn teeth, mummy. Wait, what are the... How long do I have to go? I don't know. I wish health didn't go down so fast. Alright, let's do this thing. Well, that was pretty easy. Alright. But, makes sense. No, I could just do this entire video without any, like, commentary, and it would still be, like, one of the best things ever. Oh, yeah, well, I guess we got to a certain amount of kills. 20 kills, I bet. Come on. Just gotta get, like, three more kills. Gotta be in the lead. Ooh, Booty Licious is going for the last kill. You bet I am. <gasps> yeah! Didn't even get to see the last kill. Most lethal, most frantic, most manic. My favorite weapon was not the pistol. Well, I guess that was fun. I might do another. I don't know. Bye.